Hello, warriors. Hello, fellow Americans. Hello, patriots worldwide. This is Mike, Liberty Warrior. Saturday, just enjoying my day. Um, thought I'd get on here real quick and just say hello, say thank you to all the new subscribers. Um, it's been pretty humbling, pretty amazing what's happened in the last 24, 48 hours. Um, yeah, I've had a lot of support. I've had a lot of people uh, not support, and that's fine. Um, maybe this just isn't your uh, your cup of tea, and, and you have that right, and that's fine. Um, I don't want to get into too much of what's going on right now in an American around the world. I'll save that for later tonight at 7, but uh, I just kind of wanted to talk to you about <clears throat> high vibrations, um, good energy, love. You know, I think that we have too much bad going on and too much negativity that we see constantly. And I don't know if, I don't know if we talk about enough of the good stuff and the love. Um, so I'm going to hit on it a little bit here. You know, some people may, uh, may not want to hear about God or Jesus or salvation. And that's fine. <clears throat> you don't have to be on this channel. You can go ahead and click out at any time that's your choice um but here it is we're what almost uh almost a week since easter and uh i'm walking around my place here i decided since today it's supposed to get up to almost 70 in north dakota um that i was gonna water water all my plants again and so i've kind of been walking around the yard turning hoses on putting water on my my fruit plants I've got are my fruit trees. I've got three different apple trees and a pear tree. And I think the pear tree is just amazing. It's, it's budding like crazy right now. And then I have uh, some shrubbery that we planted this last late summer, early fall. Um, some plants that we brought back from Iowa. And as you look at everything right now, it looks dead. You know, it's been a hard winter. Um, and everything's brown, looks like it's dead, you know. But then, when you put a little bit of water to it, it just greens right up, you know. Life. Life's coming back. It's kind of like what's going on in the world right now, you know. We're, uh, I know I said I wouldn't talk about it, but everything seems dead right now. And um, I think we're going to come out of this season this season and go into the new season and there's going to be a lot of life a lot of joy a lot of happiness a lot of good news <clears throat> just like the resurrection of christ you know he died and then three days later he rose again for our for our sins for our salvation he died on the cross to give us that freedom and that's what we're all fighting for right now is freedom worldwide um all of our brothers and sisters in the uk and canada and Scotland and Wales and Australia and all over the world. We're all fighting for the same thing. So as I'm walking around and the sun's shining on me and it feels warm, of course, here in North Dakota, we always have wind. I'm sitting in my Jeep, my Jeep Wrangler right now doing this video, but I really want to be outside walking around with you guys. But <laughs> The wind just won't let me. And I just feel like if I try to do a video outside, it'll be too windy and you won't be able to hear it and it'll be annoying. So I decided to hop in the Jeep real quick and do a video. It's nice in here, it's nice and warm. Um, but anyway, back to the life and, and death, you know. It just seems like at times everything is, is in that place of death. But all we need is a little truth, a little light. Shine the truth on things. Water, light, energy, positive energy good vibrations and next thing you know things start kind of popping up through the soil i got flowers getting ready to pop up that i didn't see two days ago it's it's amazing you know and i i so today i decided i was going to put some water on that and let it grow and when i get done with this video i gotta hop out and grab my little water thing and i've got some other plants that look like they're dead too but they need water you know and i think that's what we need here in this world here in the united states we need water we need uh the truth. We need Jesus Christ. We need God. Um, and I believe right now that 
it is in God's hands. I believe fully that it's in God's hands. I believe that there is going to be good news coming here real soon. Uh, things happening. We'll talk about that more tonight. Um, I just want to do a little short video. Just kind of talk about it. Talk about what I'm experiencing today as I'm walking around the ranch, the farm, just experiencing God's grace and love and the sunshine and things starting to green up here in North Dakota. I know other parts of the world and other parts of the country, it greens up a little bit faster than North Dakota. It takes a little bit longer here, but once it does, it really sticks around for a long time. You know, we, we tend to keep our green here clear into late fall. Um, back home in Idaho, things are already getting green now. They green up really quick and then triple digits hit. <clears throat> And it just kind of turns everything brown by mid-June, late June. Um, dries everything out. But here in North Dakota, um, we get enough moisture here. It kind of stays green all the way till dang near wintertime. So anyway, I just hope you're all enjoying your weekend, enjoying your Saturday um, with your family and friends. And if you haven't told somebody that you've loved them in a while, if you haven't given somebody a hug, I think today's that day. You know, extend a hand for a handshake, pull them into you, give them a hug, give your mom a hug, give your kids a hug, tell somebody that you love them. Um, you know, let's raise that vibration. Let's, let's raise that energy worldwide. I think it does make a difference, you know, and some people believe even deeper than that than I do, or maybe more than what my mind can comprehend right now, but I do believe in it. Um, I do believe it is possible that we can change things just through energy. And I think it's time that we all kind of get on board with that. Start praying. Start uh, start sharing the love. You know, Jeff did something the other day that I do every now and again. Probably not as often as Jeff, but he paid it forward, you know. Pay it forward today. Show somebody some kindness, some love. Be slow to anger. Be quick to apologize. Even if it isn't your fault, apologize anyway. We don't need strife in our lives. You know, the devil feeds off of that low vibration. The devil feeds off of strife. The devil feeds off of anger. And when you have that in your life, then you have, you have that around you. <clears throat> and it does affect you. I got a friend right now that seems to be struggling with that. And they have a hard time breaking out of that low vibration, that low energy. And, and it's amazing because it just keeps them down, keeps beating them down. They need love in their life. They need high energy, high vibration. And I, I pray for them daily. I try to show them that love. And man, they just, they just won't accept it. But you know what? I'm not going to quit on them. I'm going to continue to... Show them that love, and that's all you can do. You got to take a step back, but always be there when they need you. So today's message is just love. Show the love. Give the love. You know, your neighbor needs help. Hop over there and give them a hand. It's amazing. It's amazing how how far little deeds can go and how they can change people. Um you haven't bought your mom flowers in a while, maybe today's the day that you go get her a bouquet. Stop by and give your mom a bouquet of flowers and give her a hug for no reason other than you just love her or your wife, your girlfriend. Today's that day. Spread the love. Spread the truth. Always speak the truth. So anyway, folks, we're rolling up here on about 10 minutes. I didn't want to take up too much of your time. I hope to see all of you tonight on Liberty Warrior 7 Central. Um, we'll be speaking the truth again tonight. We got a lot of subscribers. I hope to see uh, I hope to see the live views go way up and I hope to uh, hope to meet and talk to some of you uh, that I haven't talked to yet. You know, we have live call in for a reason. It's a platform for you to speak your mind, voice your opinion. Um, you don't always have to agree with me and that's fine. I've had people call in that don't agree with my opinion 
and that's okay. We still love each other. We still respect each other. So maybe tonight's your night. Maybe you've been on that edge, on the ledge a couple of times now, and you've wanted to call in, but just didn't have that courage. Well, I'm extending my love to you. I'm extending my prayers to you. And maybe tonight's the night that you're going to be that first time caller that you've never done before. So, well, folks, world patriots, I love you guys, man. I've had so many people reach out to me uh, across the world. And I, I promise you, I try really hard to answer everybody's messages. But my, my phone is blowing up. My email is blowing up. Um, I try. I try to read everything because I think it's important to what you have to say. So don't feel like your voice is unheard on this channel. Um, I try my best. I'm not perfect. I make mistakes. I make mistakes on the show. I'm human. You know, I apologize. I'll make those corrections. So tonight's the night, folks. Tonight's the night. It's going to be Saturday night. I'm excited. I'm excited to see all of you. Tomorrow's church. Go to church with my son on Sundays. I enjoy that. Um, here in North Dakota, we got summer today. All next week's going to be winter. So we're back to 30 degrees here in North Dakota in the north. So probably sometime this week when I do my show, you might see me with a beanie on or my fur cap just because it's so freaking cold. It's insane. So anyway, this is Mike, Liberty Warrior. I'm going to go ahead and sign off. See you guys tonight.